Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Supernatural Sunday. Today I'm here to watch season five, episode 17. Last episode was pretty crazy. We started off with Sam and Dean getting shot and then they ended up in heaven and went through their past memories. We saw Zachariah. I've tried to forget that scene with him and Mary and I just, I can't. It's forever in my head. I, I wish they could mind wipe me, just, ah. And then they found this guy, I think his name is Joshua, who said that God's not gonna do anything. He's already interfered too much, so he's just gonna sit back and let things happen. So now everyone's feeling hopeless, Castiel especially, and Dean, and at the end, he tossed the amulet into the trash right in front of Sam. Dean, come on, that was unnecessary. So that's where we left off, just feeling hopeless. Before I start this episode, in the last Supernatural video, I said that when I get to season six, I'm going to start doing weekly reactions. That's not true. I'm going to start doing weekly reactions next month in January, so stay tuned. Yay. I'm so excited. More Supernatural? Yes. If I kept on pace and did reactions every other Sunday, it would take me nine and a half years to finish the show. Anyways, before I get started with this episode, make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post a new Supernatural reaction. And now it's time to watch season five, episode 17, which is called 99 Problems. I got 99 problems, but a bitch ain't one. What's going on? Dean? What, what happened? Oh, shit. Oh. Holy water, who's that? Thanks? Who are you? I hate to tell you this, but those were demons and this is the apocalypse. Yeah, we know. All right, so we got more hunters, but they don't know about Sam and Dean, or maybe they just know about them by name. Misha. Misha. Yes! Ooh. What state are we in? Who would have thought the apocalypse could be so romantic? <laughs> Seriously. I mean, end of the world. Yeah. Rob tells me you boys hunt demons. Among other things, uh, yeah. A town full of hunters. Mm. Murder on the screen or buy a condo. Now the demons were killing us, so we had to do something. Oh. Roger, you're as locked and loaded as we've ever seen. And that exorcism was a Nokia. Someone's telling you something. An angel? It's Sam and Dean Winchester. They're safe. Oh. How do you know? I know all about them. She's not the first prophet we've met. Chuck. But you are the cutest. Dean. Bobby? I don't understand. Why do you want me to say my name? Phil from Castle. Yeah, I left him a message. I, I don't think he knows how to check so, his message. We're all gonna die soon. In like a month. Maybe two. I mean it. Oh my god, yeah, we're only like five episodes away. Who says they're all gonna die? Well, they're rather than us saving them. Leah's had another vision. Oh. Well, go check it out. Wanna go to church? I'd like to offer a prayer. Sam and Dean are like... Father in heaven. Not so much. <laughs> no, but just fight. That guy looks like a version of young Dean. <gasps> Yo! Right, come on, Sam. Ooh! Hi. Yo. <laughs> <gasps> Shit. Oh no, no, no. That's not good. Oh, that's not good. No. They're gonna hate you. Back. Dylan's coming back. It's going to be okay. You'll see Dylan again. Um, Judgment Day. He'll be resurrected and whoa. together again. We've been chosen. By who? Lucifer? The angels have chosen us. I don't think. And we will be given paradise on earth. I don't, don't like this. No gambling, no premarital sex. <laughs> Dean, they basically just outlawed 90% of his personality. Well, whatever. <laughs> don't take this the wrong way. But are you on the level? I want to know what the angels are telling you. Well, 
get the rainbows. Must be nice. Being chosen. Well, Dean, you're chosen. You have to be Michael's vessel. More like cursed. Being the vessel of heaven and having no hope. And Sam's like the complete opposite. He does have hope and he's the vessel of hell. Never prayed before. I ain't starting now. If I go to hell, I'm going honest. I believe. Yeah, I do. It's just your life, though. Pretty sure God stopped caring a long time ago. What have you been? Drinking. <laughs> Total cut off from the corruption of the outside world. That's so, just some bullshit. The angels are toying with these people. Angel world, angel rules, man. And since when is that okay with you? Since the angels got the only lifeboats on the Titanic. I just watched Titanic for the first You're time last night. <laughs> no, you can't. You can't do this to me. I know one thing. One thing keeping me going. That's you. you well, I can't do this alone. It's past curfew. <laughs> you really care about that, Sam? Leah, what's wrong? Daddy, can I talk to you for a second? Oh, of course. What's up? They said they gave clear commandments, but some people aren't listening. Mm. Oh no. Oh, yeah. Sam and Dean don't even live here at Shouldn't Count. And I know there's the bartender guy, but still. You got your message. <gasps> Cass! I can find the sound of your voice grating. What's wrong with you? He's drunk. I found a liquor store. You drank it? And I drank it. You oh, I've been waiting for that line for so long. Are you okay? No. Don't ask stupid questions. <laughs> They've been speaking of this prophet. Who? This girl, Leah Gideon, she's not a prophet. The names of all of the prophets, they're seared into my brain. She's not one of them. Leah Gideon is not one of them. Hmm. What's going on? The bar, no! You got a hand, Padre? Just everybody cool down for a minute. Cool down. My friends are trying to run me out of town. I stood up at your wedding. Yes, you did, but that was then. What? And now you're standing against the flock. You want me out of here? Let's drag me. Ah, uh, I wouldn't. They will do it. Ooh! Bar fight! <laughs> oh my god. Paul. What the fuck? Paul's dead. What? Jane shot him. It's starting. What's starting? He's not even confused. He's just like, oh. On a bender. Did you say on a bender? Well, what is she exactly? The whore. Wow. Cass, tell us what you really think. She rises when Lucifer walks the earth. I was gonna say, this seems like more of Lucifer's rhetoric than the angels. The name don't you an exorcism? Fake. It actually means you uh, breed with the mouth of a goat. <laughs> That's funny, Ernest, don't you? So then how do we go pimp of Babylon all over this bitch? She killed him. That seems so much greater. It's not a sin to strike down evil. But how can the angels... You always taught me this. We have to have faith. Mm. The whore can be killed with that. There has to be a better a name besides the whore. Street. The whore can only be killed by a true servant of heaven. Servant like not you. Her father. Me. Sam, of course, is an abomination. The angel. Him. He's gonna end up killing her. Stop it. I'm gonna get somebody killed. Here we go. The next in my name will be you. <gasps> Oh my god. Yo, what's up, Padre? Pastor David Gideon. <laughs> yeah, who are you? Angel of the Lord. I'm an angel of the Lord. She's my daughter. She's not. I'm sorry, but she's not. She's the thing that killed your daughter. That's impossible, but it's true. Why does it have to be me? You're a servant of heaven. And you're an angel. Poor example of one. Yeah. <laughs> you feeling that hangover, Cass? How many should I take? All of them. You? She's probably just down the whole bottle. They're putting them in the storage unit. What, are you gonna gas it? Blow it up? There are kids in there. You're, now you realize that? Angel. You killed a guy and now you have a conscience? Really, Jane? Her true form? Oh, ew. Oh. Daddy, don't hurt no, me! No, do it. Now. Please. Please don't hurt me. Shit. Oh no, now she's gonna send everyone after him. Oh. Cass, are you okay? Okay. Oh, Please, like you're a servant of heaven. Don't be so sure. Or. Oh my god. It's actually working. Whew. 
Dean Winchester, servant of heaven. <laughs> Make sure to let the people out, the ones that are still stuck in there. Cass, are you okay? How did you do that? What? Kill her. That long run of love held out, I guess. Are you gonna do something stupid? Like what? Like, like say yes. Michael, stupid. Come on, Sam. Give me a break. You okay? Where are you going? She can grab some clean bandages out of the trunk. Relax. Dean, what are you actually gonna do? How's that? Oh? Dean? Dean, what are you doing? Don't end the episode. Oh, thank you. Where are you going? Oh? Hey. What's her name? Hi, Lisa. Yes. Lisa Braden. Just surprised. Me too. <laughs> but I wanted you to know. But what I do picture myself happy. Oh. It's with you. Wow, that this is so unexpected. Yeah, the kid. Come inside, let me get you a beer. I wow. Wish I could. He just had to get that off his chest. You can't just drop a bombshell like that and then leave. Things are about to get really bad. Is he gonna say yeah. yes? Arrangements? Whatever happens, you're gonna be okay. What do you mean? What are you talking about? Whatever you're thinking of doing, don't do it. When's the last time we saw her? Relax. Seriously, I don't remember the episode. Oh, Dean, what are you doing? So that was season five, episode 17 of Supernatural. That was a very crazy episode. I mean, we started off with this like car scene and you're just like thrown into it and you're like whoa what happened why are they all bloody why are they driving so fast what are they running away from and then we find out that they're in a town that's full of hunters and that there's this prophet but it turns out she's a fake prophet and she's yeah she's a fake prophet <laughs> i thought the episode was going to end with dean just driving away but no he went to see lisa who I mean, I, I don't remember when we saw her last. I'll have to look that up. What is Dean going to do now? I mean, he was questioning everything before and now he's really questioning stuff because how was I able to kill her? Only a servant of heaven is supposed to. So he's questioning all of that. He left Sam and Cass behind. We have five more episodes left of the season, which is insane and I know it's going to get more insane from here. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notified whenever I post my next Supernatural reaction. Next month I'll be starting weekly reactions for Supernatural and I'm very excited about it because that means we're getting to the season 5 finale faster and getting into season 6 and just, you know, watching more Supernatural. So it won't take me nine and a half years to watch hell. <laughs> yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Hey, also this episode gave us the iconic line, I found a liquor store and I drank it. I was waiting for that. <laughs>